Raphael, what do you tell a patient who wants to know what are the chances that their bone marrow can go back to normal? So I would say that we can get rid of their MDS with the treatments that we've discussed today, but we certainly can give treatments that improve the production of red blood cells by a patient's own bone marrow, and that will get rid of the need for transfusions, for example. So some of the drugs that you mentioned, the erythropoiesis stimulating agents, for example, their main job is to tell both the normal and the abnormal cells to produce more red blood cells. Some of the other therapies that we've discussed today have a very similar effect where they take some of the normal and abnormal cells and cause them to mature into more red blood cells. Now some of our higher risk patients may receive treatments like azocytidine and decytabine and we think that part of the way that they work is by knocking down the abnormal cells and allowing some sort of recovery from the normal cells that remain in the bone marrow. So through a combination of therapies we can get a person's own marrow to function better but it doesn't necessarily or at all get rid of the disease.